Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will talk about 13 things you didn't know about Janus Antetokounmpo. Originally from Athens, Greece, Greek freak Giannis Antetokounmpo was born into his family on December 6, 1994, under the name Giannis Sina Ugo Antetokounmpo. He is a professional basketball player from Greece. In 2021, he ensured that the Milwaukee Bucks won the top spot in the finals after winning against the Suns 120 to 100 with a landslide of extra points to carry the National Basketball Association championship. When basketball superstar Janis Antetokounmpo stepped up to the podium, erected outside the White House, to begin a speech he had spent hours writing and rehearsing, there was already a lump in his throat. Moments before, the President of the United States, Joe Biden, had singled him and his brother, Thanasis, out. Sons living the immigrant dream from Nigeria and then Greece in search of a new opportunity, in struggles they've always dreamed. The words struck a chord with a 26-year-old because, in truth, when the two had started their sporting journeys some 13 years ago, impoverished in the streets of Athens, not even they could have imagined that one day they would be standing in the Garden of America's seat of power as 2021 NBA champions with the Milwaukee Bucks. And yet, somehow, against all the odds, there they were. For everybody out there, Janice began with the president's own words still echoing out. If you dedicate yourself to waking up every single day and try to get better in anything you do, in anything you love and believe in your dreams, you can accomplish great things in life. Man, he added, I've done that my whole life, and I'm the White House. This is awesome. The Antigua Campo story so far is not just an NBA rags to riches fairy tale when a dose of imagination is needed, but a great case study on the power of sport and why its life changing capacity should never be underestimated. 1. Giannis Antiba Campo was born in Greece. Giannis was born in the Athens neighborhood of Sapolia, Greece. During this time, there was heavy pressure as illegal immigrants returned to their country. Adet Okumbo was born in Athens to his Nigerian immigrant parents, who the Greek government did not recognize at the time of his birth. Since the government did not recognize birthright citizenship, Janus and three of his four brothers were all thought to be stateless as the country refused to recognize them even though that was their birthplace. However, Janus's elder brother, Francis Antetokounmpo, stayed in Nigeria with a relative before both parents migrated. 2. Living in Greece was not rosy for Janus Antetokounmpo. In addition to their financial struggles, Janus's family had to contend with racism and the constant threat of deportation. On occasion, he and his siblings would go out into the streets of Athens to sell various products, such as sunglasses and watches, to generate more revenue for the family. However, things were difficult as they hid from the authorities after illegal immigrants. They often went with their mother into the street, while their father, Charles Adtokumbo, would go out looking for money to help his family see the next meal. 3. Aside from Giannis Antetokounmpo, his brothers also are basketballers. When Giannis was 13 years old, he and his brothers caught the eye of a local coach who saw potential in all four of them. Three of his brothers, Thanasis, Costas, and Alex, later became professional basketballers. One day when they were younger, their father took them to a park that happened to be adjacent to a basketball court. During this time, Janice and his brother Thanasis would go on to watch boys play on the court. It didn't take long before the two got connected with the game, which changed their future. They started playing basketball, and Janice joined a professional team in Greece named Philip Lidikos three years after they had started playing together. NBA scouts took notice of him because of his size, he would grow to be 6 feet 11 inches, 2.1 meters, and pace on the court. 4. Giannis Antetokounmpo get drafted in the NBA 2013 In 2013, the pick in the NBA's 15th overall draft was Giannis Antetokounmpo, who the Milwaukee Bucks chose. At the same time, he was able to travel to the United States by obtaining Greek citizenship. Time passed, and eventually the Antetokounmpo name became the family's official surname. 5. Giannis Antetokounmpo has contributed to the Milwaukee Bucks' history. Antetokounmpo made development, 
even as the Bucks struggled over the following several years. During the 2013-14 NBA season, Antetokounmpo played his first game for an NBA team. During the 2016-17 season, he had a career year and was named the league's most improved player. Antetokounmpo got the prize despite the Bucks' poor performance. He was commended for his offensive and defensive performance, demonstrating his versatility as a forward. The Bucks could qualify for the playoffs that year, but they lost in the first round. The team parted ways with head coach Jason Kidd during the 2017-18 campaign and hired Mike Budenholzer. As the 2018-19 NBA season came to a close, Milwaukee dominated the league thanks to the efforts of their new coaching staff and the phenomenal play of Giannis Antetokounmpo. 6. Giannis Antetokounmpo has been voted as MVP in NBA. With an NBA best 27.7 scoring average, 12.5 rebound average, and 5.9 assist average, Antetokounmpo was selected as the league's most valuable player. Unfortunately, the team's subpar showing in the postseason led to its elimination in the conference final. At the same time, the 2019-20 Milwaukee Bucks finished with the NBA's top record as it bounced them from the playoffs in the second round. The following season, Antetokounmpo earned both the MVP and the Defensive Player of the Year awards for the second time in his career. He is the third basketball star in NBA history to accomplish this feat, joining Kobe Bryant and Wilt Chamberlain. 7. Milwaukee Bucks was revived with the support of Giannis Antetokounmpo. The Bucks won the series and will start the 2020-21 season in the no. 3 position in the Eastern Conference. Milwaukee lost many series yet still managed to win it all. Upon reaching the NBA Finals, Antetokounmpo delivered one of the best individual performances in NBA Finals history. Antetokounmpo led the Bucks to four straight wins after they dropped the opening two games of the series against the Phoenix Suns. His 50-point performance in Game 6 was the determining factor in the Bucks series win. Antetokounmpo was voted the tournament's most valuable player after averaging 35.2 baskets, 13.2 reboundings, and 5.0 passes in the finals. The club has now won two consecutive championships. 8. Giannis Antetokounmpo's father is dead. Charles Antetokounmpo was born on August 3, 1963, and died on September 29, 2017 in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, United States. He was from Lagos and played for Nigeria. During his stay, he was once a soccer player for Nigeria, and he is known globally as the father of Giannis Antetokounmpo, a well-known Nigerian Greek professional basketball player. But on the other hand, the Greek freak attributes much of his current success to his father. 9. All Giannis Antetokounmpo siblings are basketballers. The Antetokounmpos are known for their performances in playing the game of basketball. However, all the children of Charles and Veronica Antetokounmpo are basketballers, of which are Giannis, Thanasis, Costas, and Alex. However, the eldest, Francis, is simultaneously a basketballer, footballer, and musician. When Charles and his wife relocated to Istanbul and Athens, they left Francis with a relative. However, this event didn't stop the bond between both brothers, as they are heavily connected. 10. Giannis Antetokounmpo is the executive producer of the movie Rise. Rise, a movie produced by Disney, is a story of the life of Giannis Antetokounmpo and how he struggled to become a well-known basketballer to date. Giannis Antetokounmpo is the executive producer of the movie Rise, while Akim Omotoso directed the 111 Minutes movie. In this movie, Akin didn't center on the game, but on the struggle. Charles and Veronica Antetokounmpo went from Istanbul, Turkey, to Athens, Greece, where they came in contact with racism and the risk of being deported. This movie showed how Janice and Thanasis fell in love with basketball, turning their family tears into laughter. Also, it's fascinating how the Milwaukee Bucks picked Giannis in the 2013 NBA draft. Those who find themselves in similar situations will find great inspiration in this film. Moviegoers will want to watch this one when it hits theaters in 2022. 11. Hard and Humble Beginnings for Basketball-Loving Brothers The brothers' journey to sporting glory started not in Greece, 
but in Nigeria. Their parents, Veronica and Charles, after struggling to find work in their native country, made the decision to emigrate to Europe in search of a better future for themselves and their families. In 1991, they traveled from Lagos to Sepolia. A year later, Thanasis was born, with Janice following two years after. When selling, his technique was to insist until eventually his goods were gone. I didn't give up. I was like, I always keep asking him questions. And I was cute too. I was young. The brothers' breakthrough moment came through Sparrows Valiniatis, a Greek amateur league basketball coach. On the hunt for new talent to join his ranks, Valiniatis would score neighborhoods trying to find raw athletic potential that could be realized into something greater. Then one day, he saw three boys running around chasing each other, a moment that changed many lives. I had a discussion with God at this moment. The Greek coach said to the New York Times, You can call me crazy, but this is the way I felt. I said, Father in heaven, am I seeing correctly? What the basketball scout particularly absorbed was the natural talent he could see oozing from Janice. He identified the size of the then 13-year-old's hands and saw the possibility of stacked in his frame. When Valiniatis met the boy's mother, he offered her and her husband jobs paying 800 euros per month on the condition that their sons would come and play basketball for him. She accepted. 12. From Phil Athleticos to the NBA, Giannis burgeoning talent wasn't initially well accepted by his new team. He lacked the obvious skills a basketball athlete should have, the capacity to dribble to a layup. And even then, he hadn't neared his eventual height. No one could see what the fuss was about this new discovery. But every time the basketball prodigy failed, he worked harder. He would stay behind in the gym, working on building his strength to keep up with his peers. He never stopped working hard and dreaming of what might be possible. Three short years later, at 16, the Antita Campos were stomping the Greek basketball scene. Even in the amateur leagues, the potential exhibited by Janus and Thanasis at Philip Lidikos was obvious, and soon scouts were flying in from the United States to catch a glimpse of these famed prodigies. In 2013, both brothers declared for the NBA draft, but an administrative hitch threatened to derail everything. Their stateless status, which had haunted them throughout their lives, meant that Giannis was effectively unable to travel. Thanasis withdrew from the draft. It was only by intervention that the second-generation immigrant finally received his Greek papers and was able to fly to New York, and on July 30, he became the 15th overall pick by the Milwaukee Bucks. Thanasis would eventually join him in the NBA. A year later after, was he selected with the 51st overall pick in the 2014 draft by the New York Knicks. 13. Giannis and Thanasis, 2021 NBA Champions Fast forward the clock to 2020 to 21 and Janice, alongside Thanasis, who joined the Bucks in 2019, were in the season of their lives. Hot off their third brother Costas, born 1997, winning the 2020 NBA championship with the LA Lakers in December, Janice went one step further in adding some prestige to the Antico Campo name and sealing his fate as a master of the court. The man known as the Greek Freak received a Supermax contract offer from the Bucks for an eye-watering $228.2 million, 190.5 million euros, on a five-year deal. As a now two-time league MVP, his franchise was confident he was worth the sum and hopeful that with that extra financial incentive, their Herculean star could bring the Wisconsin team its first title in 50 years. Did anyone expect that the Bucks would do it that same season. A sluggish regular season start and a sticky playoffs period that saw Janice injured left many unsure that the Milwaukee-based outfit would be able to prevail. Still against the odds, the Bucks pulled out a sensational final sweep. From 0-2 to two down against the Phoenix Suns, again the Bucks, driven by the might of the relentless Antito Campo spirit, pulled off a comeback to become the fifth team to win the best of seven championship series after losing the first two games. In a masterful performance, Janice peaked perfectly in Game 6 with a playoff career-high 50 points to clinch the win for his team and deliver what he had always dreamed of. 
filled with emotion, the finals MVP said afterward. I could go to a super team and just do my part and win a championship, but this is the hard way to do it. This is for my mom. She works extremely hard every day for me to be in this position, and she never pressured me to do other things. This is for my dad. He's watching from above, and he can see it. This is for my significant other. Every day, she helps me be a better person. She lets me do what I'm supposed to do. She takes care of my son and for my brothers. Make sure to watch the full video. Let me know in the comment section below. Before you go, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.